What is up everyone and welcome back to some more of The Witcher 3. In the last one we have made it to Novigrad. We have a lot to do in this one. We have to meet Triss. I already found a boat to Skellige. However, I think that I'm not gonna take it for a little while. We have quite a lot to do here first. So let's jump into it. Ready, we're doing currently the scavenger hunt, but... Well, we also have this one too. <laughs> we have so much. This is part one. Diagrams to all the elements. I have so many random parts. <laughs> we definitely have to keep exploring more in this whole area to see if we can find part two. I don't know where this relates into it. Glistening before his eyes. <laughs> um... I guess we could do this one. Where is this one? If it's in here, I'll do it. Yeah, it is. It is this one. Okay. So we're going to head towards there. I'm going to go to this first because I want all the notice boards. Oh, there's still two notice boards down here too. And one over... Gee, we have so much to do and I'm loving every moment of it. <laughs> the streets anymore. Oh, oh, ah! oh sorry. Ah! Oh, oh, man. To the eternal fire. Ah! Sorry, everyone. Coming through. Oi, cocker. What? You want something? Shut off, ass munch. What? You wanted to talk to me. You're lucky I can't get in there right now. Or else I would. Ooh. Hello. How's everyone doing? <laughs> Just coming in to say hi. The horse whistler, nice. A dumpling. Always nice. Oh yeah, I read that one. Ooh. Sorry, I'm out of here. Oh. Ooh. Not There's so Not many people in this town. <laughs> I keep running into all of them. Excuse me. Okay, let's go get this notice board oh, over here. The oh, you gotta you. take risks and not get fat. Hey, boy. What is this? Can I get through? When did you last touch a wench? <laughs> I need a key. What's she cried? Bouncer. Oh, that's an interesting. You okay? But of course. Yes? What is it? Um, uh, I'm just here passing through. <clears throat> As I lose my voice. Damn it, I can't go through there. Are they blocking me from getting over there? Oi, Cocker! Hey. Oh, it's Pretty a hospital. Boy. Okay, that explains a lot. What do I gotta do to get a lovely pal like yours? Huh. Some wrestling oh. posed as young Borstbeard? And clean that his account at the Vivaldi's bank. <laughs> I'm not certain I believe that. Oh, another one. I don't know if I should be lighting all of these. Ooh. What can I do? Oh, look, I can go down here. Is this do you think this is the other side? Light my path. So much to explore. <laughs> So many treasure hunts to do. Is this gonna pop me up right to where I was? That'd be hilarious. <laughs> My great gate you've got going on. Oh! Kinda got scary. <laughs> Mood change. Maybe that's the way from where I saw before with that bouncer. Oh, this is creepy. Ooh. Ooh. Man, you came out of Oh shit. I you came out of nowhere actually. <laughs> that was 
not ready for that at all. <laughs> I was like, the other one scared me, but that one behind me <laughs> scared me more. Nothing back here. Oh, we're back. I like try to keep these lit so that I know where I have come from. Let's go, Geralt. This time I'm checking behind me. <laughs> of course, it's Shit. a water hag. The hell in his eye. How to use it. Really? Where's our illusion? Just wonderful. Of course, there's two now. You guys just had to join the party, huh? Come on. Get out of here. Why are you chasing me? <laughs> Drowner is annoying because it won't just come over here. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Stay here. Oh, the damage is on. Come back. Oh. I thought I had just a simple <laughs> water hack point, but I was mistaken. Where there's a water hack, there's always drowners. Ah, right here. Ooh. Okay, we gotta keep track, because there is a ladder that I could have gone up, but I'm gonna go back to that. Can I read that? No. Interesting. Hmm. Some stuff up here, too. Ooh. Ooh, superior vampire oil, nice. Keep on lighting my way. I wonder where I'm going. Oh, this leads outside. Makes sense. What's this way? Hmm. Oh man. Okay, we can make the gap. Yep, good job. <laughs> this is when I would mess it up. Ooh. That's cute. Ooh, where am I? I definitely got distracted. That's, That's so pretty, but he can't keep his hands off himself. With you. Not for all the gold in Novigrad. But I, th I thought you just complimented me. What? <laughs> oh, where where am I? <laughs> this is not where I was expecting to be. I was Ooh. made for loving. Mm. Hi, guys. Uh, I don't know what you're all doing. Is this... It must be. Come on, Geralt. We gotta get out of here. Damn it, I don't need butter knives. I kind of want to go back, though. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to interrupt. How's it going, everyone? Someone at the ball said that thug used to be a Redanian count. I must say, I'm curious what my wife would say about that. Listen, there's more. Word is, she's not his daughter at all. Did you hear the juicy bit from the last race day? The vehicle that. The ah, too many people are talking. Now. a whole bundle in villages, and he lost. You know what, you guys have fun. I'll join you guys later. Oh, sorry. No, a headache oh. again. But. Bits. I swear there was a ladder. Hold on, <laughs> let's run back this way. I 
Where there was. There it is. <laughs> I knew I'd seen it. Is this gonna be locked? I think it is locked. Let me in. Okay, damn it. <laughs> Fine, back we go. <laughs> Interesting little underground area, though. But we're getting distracted. We need to get on the hunt for this Witcher armor. That is my goal. Along with talking... Along with meeting Triss. Who apparently lives here. So... Loitering round here. I'm guessing I shouldn't steal in front of you. Ah, the the notice board that I took <laughs> so long to get to. Reminder: the most honorable townspeople, please remember to warn any passerbyers who might be currently found beneath your win window before emptying your chamber pots. I love that. <laughs> Stay out of the sewers. I just came out of the sewers. We would like to inform all venerable residents of Novigrad that last week the temple guard fished three bodies of the following descriptions out of the city sewers. Male, moderate age, clad in rich apparel, with a birthmark on his upper shoulder. Female, elderly, dressed in blue nightshirt and numerous blunt trauma wounds all over her body. Male, young, naked, indecent tattoo on his groinal area. These bodies will be examined and identified by the end of the month, then cremated. We would like to take this opportunity to warn our dear townsmen and women against entering the sewers, despite continual efforts on the part of the, our brave temple guard, the remained extraordinarily dangerous place. A word from the Armorer's Guild. I think I did read that one. We coin fast. Non-humans in Vivaldi. Bank Sayer. Credit's no good. Oh! Can't I go to that bank to change out my other coins? I've been trying to find a bank for that exact reason. <laughs> Church of the Eternal Fire seeks to purchase firewood. Um, beware of the thief. Bald man rolling down a barrel with the street giggling to himself. He called himself Odrin. Okay. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> Merchant. Is that so? Hello. Don't be shy now. Looking doesn't cost a thing. There's plenty to behold. This here is a collection of wonders that belong to the mage Eremas. A once in a lifetime opportunity. How do you get a hold of these? Never heard of a mage willingly parting with his treasures? No one asked Eremas his will. He was burned at the stake a fortnight ago. Strange they didn't burn his stuff with him. Witch hunters let you resell it just like that? Why wouldn't they? These are common goods, some valuable only as collectibles, perhaps. Hmm. Ooh. All right, I get it. These items aren't actually common. Rumor has it, each is an enchanted key. Oh. Rumor happened to mention where to find the locks these keys open? Sadly, that no. interesting. What if I knew you could hardly expect me to sell them? Where did Aramus live? Had a lovely residence south of Oxenford. Badly damaged now, as he made the hunters pay dearly for his skin. Show me what you have. Ooh. His lizard figure. This is gonna cost a lot, isn't it? <laughs> I'm taking it though. Oh, this one's cheap. Jade figurine. Old wine from Toussaint. Curious cases of virtuous Vega. What else do you have? A miraculous guide to Gwent. <laughs> Maybe I need that. <laughs> but I don't want to take off my other ones. Okay. Farewell. Oh, we have Statuette of a man. Wasn't carved, but produced using magic. Shame I can't ask Triss about it. Why not? Or we can. Maybe it's time to go give Triss a visit. Where is it? 
Pyres of Novagran. Let's go, let's go give Triss a visit. Has come for me. It's clear as the eternal fire. Okay, so don't steal in front of them. You know, I've gone through most of this town just <laughs> taking stuff that I didn't think it would be that much of a problem. Winds howling. I was so confused at first. I was like, "What's happening?" In life, you gotta take risks. Don't get fat. Triss Marigold, witch and harlot, is wanted for the practice of black magic and conspiracy against the crown. Information leading to her capture will be rewarded. Ooh. So she is hiding in the town where people want her. Are there more people burning her? Uh, youth these days. They're brained, all of them. My God. <laughs> Give us a crown. Sir, spare me a cup for a buy bread. I swear it. How do you do? I've had enough of living. Over here? It's like a witch with muscle. Cast a spell and all's gone in a flash. Well, she was in a rush. Must have left some. Oh? Hey! Sud off! We're looting here! Not here for the loot. Interested in the sorceress who lived here. And we're supposed to believe that. Yeah. Most likely hiding in some rat trap with the rest of them. Who's she hiding from? Well, I can't Temple have guards idea. cracking down. <laughs> All mages are fair game. Yeah, they round them up like rats. Someone's got to know more. I'd look for her in a putrid grove. Putrid Grove. Interesting, as names go. Oh, I've a scum and freakery if there ever was one. No decent folk show their hides there. That why you think I should look for my friend there? Oh, I meant no offense. Putrid Grove. Where is it? I wouldn't know. Rumor has it, it's a place for freaks and oddities. You'd fit in well there. Maybe. <laughs> Thing is, gotta know how to get there. They say you gotta get there through the sewers, but you gotta enter them outside of town. Few know where exactly, though. Ask a beggar, or spot yourself a thief. Follow him. Beggars and thieves gotta pay tribute to the king of beggars. Word is, they do it in a grove. Mean to say the local beggars have a king, crown, scepter, and all that? Wouldn't scoff, mate. King of beggars, it's a moniker. Yeah, for a man who everyone in Novigrad respects deeply. And watch yourself. Menger himself don't even go to the grove. Someone call for me. Wonder why. Oh, he was the it's one Menger. that. Temple God. Oh. Um. Thieving vermin to the confession chamber. What, but sir, what's the offence? This is some sorceress bitchy shop. Think that gives you the right to steal her property? Well, sorcerers. Majors of all types are outlaws. But by law, the temple guard takes possession of their belongings. And the rule of law still holds in Novigrad. Mingo. The one that burned the... You know a bat can sniff out a moth a mile away. Got nothing to do with their sense of smell. It's about their hearing. 
Well, well. Man knows his bats. Here I thought you only cared about monsters. And as bats sense moths, so I sense freaks. And start by warning them. Novigrad's no place for your kind. I haven't done anything wrong. But you will. Sooner or later, your sort always causes trouble. And this city's mine to protect. Mine and the Eternal Fires. Nothing I can do to you now, but just know that I know you're here. One misstep, one error, you'll make a mistake is inevitable. <laughs> I'll be the I feel first to out learn of I just it. Stormed. And when <laughs> Everyone. I do, it'll be standard procedure. Like for every magic oddity who dares taint this city's air. Be seeing you. Oh, I might as well look around. Oh shit, do you think they'll notice? So we have to find the King of Beggars. Now that Superior beast oil, damn. Hey, yeah, I wanted to read these. <laughs> I should read that one. Oh, wait. Oh. Interesting. Curious cases of the virtuous Vega. Can there be s uh, such a thing as a virtuous whore? Vega asked herself this question each and every morning, and each morning swore she would prove the world that practicing the world's oldest profession does not preclude virtue. This determination augmented not only her own troubles, but also those of uh, Gaspard de Brule, her mother's longtime friend who, with a personal favor, had hired Vega to work in his establishment, the Golden Garter. Poor Gaspard had to listen to the constant complaints of customers who would charge into his office and huff about Vega's behavior. Yet the girl clung firm to her principles and her ironclad drive to see them through. She would never perform with any lights lit and would avert her gaze with a powerful blush upon catching sight of the male member. Gaspar's greatest headache, however, was the fact that the virtuous Vega never ever accepted any payment for her services. Hmm. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Scholars have many vices, probably the worst among them is the tendency to describe the simple and unnecessarily complex terms, to dress the plain in the garb of false learning. The conjunction of the spheres might serve as an excellent example of this. The name, so mysterious to a commoner's ear, could be replaced with a much simpler alternative when the worlds collided. The phenomenon itself can be explained in terms of simple enough for a child to understand. Imagine, dear reader, that our world is a ship sailing on a great sea. From its deck, we can see other distant vessels. Those are the stars. These, sim these vessels each bear their own goods and their own crews. They usually pass us at some distance, barely visible specks, even viewed through the spyglass. Once every few thousand years, however, a storm breaks above this cosmic sea. A storm so strong it tosses the ships towards one another, making them sail cheek by jowl. Part of the crew of the one of the ships can at such times move to another and some cargo on one ship can spill into the neighboring vessel. When the weather is calm, the ships separate once again and sail their separate ways. Invariably different ways. The so-called post-conjunction begins. Namely, monsters such as ghouls and basilisks are precisely such passengers from another vessel, and we humans are castaways, flung against our will from somewhere far away onto a world previously inhabited by the elder races. Once here, we learned the arcane mysteries of magic, Un unbeknownst to us before we could could the worlds collide once more perhaps can this cataclysm be avoided or the opposite hastened some scholars believe that there are beings who have mastered the skill who possess rare genes allow which some to seize the helm of our vessel and steer us to save our waters or to our doom that's really interesting actually 
Look at all these graffiti. I wonder what that says. Hairbrush. Only ever known Triss to use one like this. Um, I hope you don't mind that I'm stealing all your books. Herbs? Roots? Triss turned to healing? Hmm. Amulets are emanating magic. Gotta be Triss's. She was allergic to potions. Allergic to potions? A dumpling. <laughs> to add to my dumpling collection. I probably have so many now. Oh? Trisses. Never knew how to drop them on the floor. Ooh. Rose of Remembrance. The Rose of Remembrance. All dried up. Oh. Okay, well. The Rose of Remembrance. I wonder if I can look at that. I wonder if that would be in quest items. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, let's go. Deepest apologies, Governor. Fetch some metal, you wretch. I've been robbed! Thief! Well, I guess I'm following. <laughs> fire, why me? Ooh. Shit, where'd they go? Oh shit, I lost them. How is business? Where'd they go? Look for the thieves? Oh, down here. Next, Sorry, I got confused. <laughs> Hello? Was I supposed to follow Hello. them? Man, everyone is drunk right now. <laughs> Jeez. Me? The war oh, drink. man, I, the I'm not too thing. sure now. <laughs> I have sworn they went into there. So we gotta look for thieves. So maybe the shady individuals. Now you the ace. We gotta carefully follow them. Okay. Let's try this again. Where are they? Shit. I think I have failed horribly. Ah. 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 <laughs> Let's try this again. I'm warning you. Okay. Townsman. Okay. Okay. I found one. He sensed something. Gotta stay further back. Don't lose sight this time. I wonder how close I can get. Oh. Uh. I'm just gonna make sure we see. You okay? Jeez. Am I too close? There, huh? Eight at the Kingfisher. You're sorted for at least two days. Just gotta adjust the good position where they toss the lift home. You know the Ballad of Wonder? Sir, oh. sir, be merciful. Oh. Give us a crowd, eh? 
Me mum's sick, and if I don't feed her, well, she's like to die hunger. Um, I'll just take it. Here. Thank you, you gold-hearted man. I need to ask you Can't questions. You hear me, Tyler, but I also need Some to other follow. time. I'm in a hurry. Yeah. Oh, do you think it was the ladder that I had taken before <laughs> that I couldn't get up to? Oh, no, it's not. <laughs> I thought it was. Okay. Stay a little further back. And go a little further. Okay. Oh, God. Not the shady individual. Now I'm going to get them confused. Oh, God. Oh. Hand off. I can't even tell who handed off what. How much oh shit! They you, the townsman? Oh He's man! I sense something. Got to stay further back. <laughs> I'm terrified. See, yeah, I want to follow the shady no. individuals, but oh fuck! Don't write me now. For the horses. <laughs> it's clear as the eternal fire. Fish market. Okay, so far so good. Mom, we've got to be close. Oh god, this is getting confusing. Um, I see him still. Lovely natural slash. Okay. Is that the door I need to go into? Officer, taking a rest for witch hunting. Greetings, Your Honor. Good to see you again. Can I approach? Green is the usual. Of course. Keep this up and you'll earn yourselves a preferential rate. Good, I enjoy shopping. Oh, nice. Open up. Who are you and what do you want? <laughs> Doing some sightseeing. Kind of curious about what's beyond this gate. My brother-in-law was curious. Worms been eating him for five years now. Take a look. What do you see? Yellow eyes. Pair of swords. Mutated killer, me thinks. Heard this place was a meeting spot for oddities. Heard right. Know the password, get him free. Don't know it. Got to contribute to the Graves upkeep. Hmm. Don't know the password. Pay up then. Damn it, how much is it? 50? Let me in. I won't pay. Let me in. Yes, sir. <laughs> and then I'll just learn the password and come back. Okay. Interesting. What ails you? Oh, it's it's <laughs> Thank you, my lord. A right miracle you've worked. I'd like to repay you. Convince those knaves on the city council that spells are not needed on a whim, but positively indispensable. Oh, I won't listen, my lord. They're scared of anger. In that case, 
Please convey that if any of them should fall ill, he can stick his head in the flames of the eternal fire. Now, permit me some rest. It's a material world? Mum, look what I found! That's a pearly necklace. Where'd you get it? it? was lying in the street, so I took it. <laughs> you look me straight in the eyes and lie, just like your pa. <laughs> You're a good lad. <laughs> now go play. Mummy's got to get some sleep before she goes. So, how are things? Good. More and more people come to our secret clinics looking for help. It's about time we made something clear, sorceress. Yes, high time. Me and my men will manage just fine without the help of you or any other mages. But you, well, without our help, you'll sit in ducks for the temple guard. Who do I spy? Geralt? Ventress. See you two know each other. See you two know each other well. <laughs> I was curious whether you'd managed to find me, Witcher. So you're the king of beggars, huh? Your spies tell you I was looking for the Putrid Grove? My skull would be a home for bottom-feeding river fish if I didn't keep an ear to the ground. And please, Putrid Grove? Ugly name for our cozy little hideout, wouldn't you say? Yeah, I was curious about this. Temple How did they not come in here? Your little operation. Yeah. Let's say they appreciate the value of a Novigrad crown. Hmm. Mm. Manga doesn't seem like the type that can be bought. Also true. Anyone can be bought. Ooh. But like it's true, Manga had cost like me a fortune. Something to say for that. Luckily, he's got officers, and they're mere mortals. Illnesses catch him at times. Other times, they want to catch a bit of diversion. See, Witcher? I've got plans. Big plans. Far-reaching plans to reshape this city head to toe. Ever thought of seeking a seat on the city council? City council is a puppet troop with a hierarchy of the Church of the Eternal Fire as its puppeteer. Until recently, that is when Radovid and his witch hunters took the reins. The semblance of power don't interest me. A man with a vision. One day, the so-called free city of Novigrad will be truly free. But before that can happen, we got a riddit of superstition farting around about the hallowed essence of the eternal fire. Nonsense for kiddies. Apparently not. Cheering crowd at the execution. Mm. Mostly adults. Any crowd a rabble will cheer to the stench of burning flesh. Well, one day, folk will understand the eternal fire's naught but a leash around their necks. They call this place the Putrid Grove. But it's the rest of Novigrad that's putrefied. This year's the last bastion of normality, sanity, reason. I'm actually glad someone like you's found his way to our city. Because it will be our city one day, Geralt. Mark my words. Yours, plural. Yeah, mine. And me friends. But that's a tale for another time. <laughs> for now, I'll leave you two alone. Because like I can see, <laughs> well, you clearly need it. <laughs> Geralt, I have a lot of things to take care of in town. I'll be glad to tag along. Now this is gonna get interesting. <laughs> That's an awkward look. What's your arrangement? He using you? Helping me to survive, actually. Six months ago, if somebody said Triss Marigold would be working for a Novigrad criminal, I'd never have believed it. Six months ago, Triss Marigold parted with someone very dear to her and had to start anew. Hasn't turned out like I imagined. Come on, let me give you a taste of my life. Madam Sorceress. Beautiful as ever. Damn shame to part. Don't fret. Bound to be back soon. <laughs> I take it you're a Novigrad on important business. Important doesn't do it justice. I'm looking for someone. More precisely? 
Young woman, who's like a daughter to me. Her? Here? No, impossible. She was here. There are witnesses, evidence. Was hoping you'd heard something. You've been here a while. I need you to help me find something, anything, a trace. I'll do everything I can, of course. Who might know more? Hmm. I want to know more. <laughs> I'm really curious between her relationship with Geralt and if she knows um, if her and Yennefer know each other. I mean, they are both soul sources. Hello, Klug. Managed to get those magic incense ingredients? Yes, somewhat with <laughs> uh, difficulties, you might say. I was walking along the canal with a sack full of goodies for you. Looked up and spied a trio of temple guards coming the other way. Get to the point, Klug. No time today for one of your long stories. Wait! A sack full of magicalities and they were coming straight towards me. I don't easily frighten, but uh, I felt a cold sweat on my arse I did. I'm afraid I had no choice. I dropped the sack in the water. I had to. When asked why, I claimed it contained a dead cat. You shan't believe this, but they believe me. I need that package, Klug. I've got a contract. It must be on the canal bed. Luckily, it was heavy enough to sink. I'm sure it'll turn up if you search. You expect me to pay you, then die for my goods into that ice-cold filth? I have a feeling I'm gonna end up doing it. Yep. <laughs> I'll do it. <laughs> I can do that. Where'd you toss the package? Near the crane. Second bridge in from the harbor. I didn't expect such devotion. Wanted to freshen up anyway. Let's go. Stop. Hear that? They've come for us. The fool didn't break until I began to prick his heels. Every man's got his sensitive spots. Interrogated a mage once. Pain couldn't touch him. Tore off his fingernails, crushed his bollocks. Nothing. Turned out, he was devilishly ticklish. <laughs> I placed a beetle on his belly and set a mug atop it. Damn near went mad. We were lucky this time, but... You'd best leave via the sewers. The trapdoor's in the floor. Take care of yourself, Klug. Trapdoor? <sighs> a new way to the sewers. Okay, let's go. Whee. Oh god, you hear that? Of course. Insectoid oil. I don't even know if I have enhanced. There's a draft. Should be an exit here. Klug wouldn't have sent us here if there wasn't. Must be a lever on this wall that'll open a secret passage. Hmm. Okay, I will find. I'll find the lever. Oh, I found it. Bam. Free city of Novigrad. Name actually used to mean something. The very reason so many mages came here after the massacre at Loch Muin. Thought they'd be safe from Radovid's Reapers. Instead, they jumped out of the frying pan into the fire. But Novigrad stands on top of a mountain of coin. And winning a war takes three things. Coin, coin, and even more coin. That's why they're exterminating mages, confiscating their property and possessions. And they'll go after non-humans next. The elves occupy slums, but the dwarves practically control financial life in the city. Official word is that Novigrad will remain neutral. Somehow doubt anyone believes that anymore. Hmm. Judging by what Klug said, the parcel should be around here on the bottom. Unless the poor man was mistaken. He's been forgetful ever since Manga interrogated him. Seems to be suffering from a persecution complex, too. Current must have carried the sack seaward. I'll swim towards the port. Coming with? 
but maybe some other time. Don't know what you're missing. <laughs> Water's thick with pungent oils. Guessing it'll do wonders for my complexion. <laughs> I guess I'm going in. I think I see it. Did you see that little twirl I did? How adorable. <laughs> little spin under. Oh man. Oh, right here? Come on. No, get up. Please. <laughs> there we go. Easy peasy. I have acquired it. Find the parcel? Or did you get wet for no reason? Nothing like a refreshing swim in a filthy canal. <laughs> Found a few fish, a rusty anchor, the carcass of a boat. Oh, and this. <laughs> Hope the contents aren't soaked through. Oh, you're a doll. We continue forward. Seem to be in your element. Still remember my elements? How I use them? Come on. Six months isn't that long. It's not like I'm senile. Six months. But you do have a history of amnesia. I've recovered my memory completely. Good. That should stop people from taking advantage of you. Someone's been taking advantage of me. I have, for one. I've never even intimated. We need to hurry. <laughs> Armed ruffians in town. What say you we are both? Oh, oh. Hey, you all right? The Pilar's death. Greetings, sorceress. Greetings, Brandon. I didn't expect you to bring company. Triss, you told this man you're a sorceress? Of course. She was looking for work. That's her chief asset. Are you, Triss? I know it was reckless, but competition's stiff here. No one would hire me if I claimed to be a common rat catcher. More importantly, no one would believe such a beauty could be an exterminator of rodents. <laughs> but I'd prefer you not to tarry and begin. Triss, you and Brandon here. You've agreed a price. We settled on a full coin purse. Brandon & Co. is a serious outfit. We've the largest granary in all Novigrad. Hmm. You're a merchant, familiar with how commerce works. Of course. Honest pay for honest work. Half up front, half once the job's done. You're asking a great deal. I'm a witcher. Gotta admit, I've met my share of people who say one thing beforehand, another after the fact. Mm. Very well. Your first installment. We need to place these crystals around the granary, near anything that looks rat-related. So we're catching rats now. <laughs> Sounds about right. I love your hair. I'll cover half the space. You take the other half. Look for evidence of rat activity. Mm -hmm. I found that. Is, I know what evidence of manticore activity looks like, but rodents. Geralt, we both rather be somewhere else. I'd rather be sitting in a royal council meeting, but they killed my king. Look for crevices and droppings. Once we place this incense, what then? I'll cast a spell and the rats will leave. Can't do that without sprinkling incense. Don't really feel up to looking for rat shit. Stop whining. Okay, you got this spot, right? I'll go check over here, I guess. Like right here. Looks like a good spot. I don't like that guy. Brandon? I don't either. He's much too fat. <laughs> Can't help but agree. But no. Notice how he didn't try to haggle? <laughs> Must really want the rats out. Triss, he's a merchant. He makes his living by haggling. If I worried about that sort of thing, I'd starve to death in this city. Hmm. But like Geralt's usually right with his feelings. Now I'm kind of worried. Is this a trap? It might be. Maybe he's sent for Menge. Am I going... Trick? Think I plugged every hole in there. Alright. Get ready for some magic fireworks. 
Once I activate the assets, we'll have a moment to talk. That scared me. <laughs> that was so loud. Well, now we wait for them to scurry away. Interesting method. Never had much luck with rats. Once I hit one with a fork in complete darkness, trying to show off my witcher's senses. Masterful throw, really. Problem was, no one else saw it. How could they in the dark? <laughs> so, what do you think? Rat catcher? It's a long way to fall from being advisor to Temeria's king. I'm just glad to see you safe and sound, and... Reconciled? I was worried about seeing you again. Doubted it could be pleasant. We said everything there was to say six months ago. I don't want to go back to that. I'm not going back to it. It's just... It's one thing to say something, it's another to actually do it. We promise to remain friends. I hope nothing will change that. So, tell me how Yen's doing? How do you know I found her? You didn't answer my question. <laughs> How's Yen? She's fine. That's good. Asking about anything specific? Never mind. I got my answer. Well, well. Are lovebirds having themselves a little chat instead of working? The job's done. Geralt, those are... I know who they are, Triss. My friends begged me to notify them if mm -hmm. I encountered a mage, sorceress, what have you. Didn't have the heart to refuse. Mm -hmm. It's a trap, Geralt. This stank from the start. <laughs> Geralt let's knew. Let's agree your like friends were never here. Know. Now pay the rest and let's part in peace. You don't set the terms, mutant. Stay out of it. We're here for the witch. We're inseparable, see? Afraid you'll have to take us both. Geralt! If you say so. All right, we've talked. Do what you gotta. Just remember, I can't help but get in your way. Heard enough from this horse, son. As have I. Neither is to leave here alive. Yeah, run away. You wouldn't find us if you wanted to. That guy's just getting <laughs> wrecked by our Yeah. That bastard hired me on the assumption he wouldn't have to pay me. Duped and trapped like a child. If not for you, we need to find Brandon. Oh, we're gonna find him. Oh. Don't kill me. Good sir, no. Mm -hmm. They forced me. Oh, really? Had I not told them, they'd have set fire to my home, my well, warehouse. Their attitudes the changed mage so hunters much. know no mercy. Uh huh. Spare me, good man. Be not like those murderers. Shut up. I should kill you. Thing is, you'd be no good to anyone but the gulls as a corpse. So you'll live and pay us double. Now. I say triple. F fine. Your coin. Now get. Mm hmm Thanks. The much. attitude change. Uh-huh. <laughs> no need. Glad I could help. You know, I've been thinking who might know something about Siri. And I just got an idea. There's an Oniromancer in town, Kareem Tilly. Very capable, supposedly. Never trusted in Dreamer's abilities myself. Dreamers. Kareem's been very effective. You should at least try. She's taken a job close by. Follow the canal away from the fish market. The house is near the first bridge. Its owner, Dijon Kier, is a rich banker. 
Not coming with me? I've got some things to take care of. Another rat-infested warehouse? <laughs> Not exactly. Nothing even remotely satisfying. Such are the times. Hmm. Thanks for everything, Seatrice. Mm-hmm. See you. How do I find you if I need you? I live in the bits. Head up the hill, past the fish market. Stop by. Be seeing you. No. Got a case of the bloat. No. I actually... Have I read her, um... Her entry? I don't know if I have. Okay, so she was the former mage advisor to King Foltest. That's right, so she, the Temerian king. Hmm. Get overview of at one point found her allure irresistible. From then on, the two shared feelings that ran far deeper than a superficial and fleeting fancy. Yennefer told Geralt that Triss had recently taken up residence in the free city of Novigrad. Oops. Seems Triss had gone into hiding from the so-called witch hunters persecuting magic wielders in the city. Um. After a bit of run around, Geralt found the sorceress who had indeed entered into the arrangement of the so-called King of Beggars. She paid for his protection by providing magic services to his organization, though Triss did not know anything about Ciri and her stay in Novigrad, she promised to do all within her power to aid Geralt's search. Though, theoretically, Triss and Geralt had ended their romance half a year earlier, it was clear the feelings they felt for each other had not vanished so easily. To deal with this, the sorceress pretended that nothing had happened, and the witcher, as is his wont, sheepishly masked his feelings with a mix of hesitant interest and fake indifference. It must be said that both of them handled the situation quite awkwardly. That's... <laughs> you know, I would agree. <laughs> so we have a lot to do. Okay. Non-human, are you? Look for your kind beyond the walls. So I wonder if I can ask her about that other quest, too. Let's see. A diary of darkness. Novigrad merchant told Geralt about a mage named Aramas, and the poor man had, like so many of others' colleagues, met a gruesome death on a pyre. With no surviving heirs, his expansive rural residence was now abandoned, and if the rumors about this eccentric sorcerer were true, inside it awaited a great many curiosities and valuable secrets. A jade statuette. It was a form of a nobleman and emanated a strange energy. The Witcher decided to purchase it and show it to Triss. I can talk to her about it. Okay, we're gonna do that next. <laughs> well, we met Triss and I am excited to continue going through this whole area. I'm glad that we get to talk to her about this other item as well that we found from the merchant. And I'm curious to see what more this Mange and the King of Beggars has to offer as well. Seems like Triss and Geralt still have some feelings possibly i don't know where we're gonna go with that but <laughs> i hope to learn more about about their relationship beforehand it is really interesting she did ask about yennefer but i don't know if she was asking in a way that like asking if they were back together again or if i had answered that differently if it would have been different if i had said i don't know very interesting but we'll see in the next one <laughs> huge thanks to all my patrons have a nice night everyone